Hello, my name is Ben Lovegrove and in this video I'm going to briefly describe 11 of the most interesting and innovative aircraft of the future, manned and unmanned. With the rapid development of aero engines, airframe structures and software, we can look forward to many new aircraft in our skies in the years ahead. Many will be quieter with much lower carbon footprints. Some are designed for speed, reducing the time taken to fly between continents. Others are being planned to alleviate the congestion on our roads by carrying passengers between and within cities. So let's look at our 11 examples. Washington-based Zunum Aero has been working on designs for a family of 10 to 50 seat mid-range hybrid electric aircraft. The aptly named Zunum, Mayan for hummingbird, is backed by JetBlue technology and Boeing Horizon X. The company was formed in 2013 and plans to have a prototype flying by 2019. The German company Volocopter have built and flown their first electrically powered VTOL air taxi and carried their first passenger. They are now continuing their research and development with the Volocopter 2X Multicopter. After several successful flights and positive receptions at exhibitions, Volocopter hope to start training commercial pilots by 2020. Boom Technologies' supersonic jet is designed to fly at Mach 2.2. The design resembles the much-missed Concorde, and it is envisaged that once again passengers would be able to cross the Atlantic in half the time of today's airliners. The cost would be equivalent to current business class seats. The project is being backed by the Virgin Group and Japanese Airlines, and the first commercial flights are planned for 2023. 2023 could also be the year that sees the first test flights of Lockheed Martin's new business jet. The Arian AS2 is designed for business passengers and will have room for 12 travelling at Mach 1.4 over water and 1.2 over land. At such speeds, the flight time across the Atlantic could be cut by 3 hours and the Pacific by 5. Lockheed are well known for the development of fighter jets and the Arian AS2's engine will be based on the one that powers the F-16. The continuing development of aero engines is resulting in all kinds of advantages. Critics of aviation often point at the level of noise pollution, but over the decades aircraft have become quieter and quieter. This trend looks set to continue with Spike Aerospace's ambition to create the world's quietest supersonic jet. Their design should soften the sonic boom of the jet passing overhead at Mach 1.6. Boeing are working on an unmanned hypersonic surveillance aircraft or spy plane capable of flying of up to Mach 5. No aerospace company has yet designed and produced a successor to the SR-71 Blackbird, but this could be it. This aircraft has been dubbed the Son of Blackbird and will fly at speeds of up to 3,836 miles per hour. Airbus are also developing new aircraft. One of these is the Airbus Vahana, named after the aerial chariot of the gods in Hindu mythology. This was the first of Airbus Group's A-cubed projects. It's a self-piloted eVTOL aircraft designed to carry cargo or a single passenger. The prototype made its first flight at Pendleton, Oregon on January the 31st, 2018. Another Airbus project is the City Airbus. This is also an eVTOL aircraft and its larger size is designed for transporting passengers around congested cities. It's an air taxi concept that will carry four passengers and the pilot at speeds of up to 75 miles per hour. Imagine hailing one of these taxis to cross London or New York. Meanwhile in the UK, Samad Aerospace is forging ahead with designs for hybrid aircraft. Their Starling Jet Electric Hybrid looks set to revolutionise local air travel with eVTOL capabilities, low noise and low pollution. Takeoff and landing will be electrically powered, thus reducing noise and pollution in built-up areas. The efficient diesel turbofan engines combined with a sleek airframe design will provide fast delivery of passengers from city to city. The dream of a viable flying car has been present within aviation design since the 1950s. Now, thanks to new materials, computing power and design, it seems it's finally a reality. 
The Slovakian manufacturer Aeromobil has two designs, the Aeromobil 4.0, the current design, and the Aeromobil 5.0, planned for 2025. You've heard the expression, if it looks right, it'll fly right. Well, check out their website and you'll probably agree that these are the flying cars we've been looking for. Finally, another electrically powered commuter aircraft in development is Aviation's Alice Commuter. It is designed to carry up to nine commuters from and to towns and cities. It has distributed propulsion with a push engine aft and a smaller engine on each wingtip. It is one of two new designs from Aviation. The other is the Orca UAS. Check them out at aviation.co. That concludes this brief look at 11 of the aircraft designs of the future. Have you noticed others that should be on this list? Add a comment below with your ideas. Please give this video a like and share it with anyone you think might be interested. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this.